Last night was leftovers in bed and falling asleep to a playlist of affirmations on YouTube, hoping that prepping tomorrow with positive focus would plant a seed in the heart of this anxious meat suit, meant to protect my bones from chattering too loudly. Thin walls in tenement housing, life in the big city and such. I think that there is an inherent restlessness in seeking honest, in more nuanced story, higher resolution, more filled in. Everywhere there's distraction, but if that's where we are, then we are here now. After all these years in this same meat suit, I'm still nervous at night for the following day, before I've even arrived. I have no projected breath, no essential wisdom to keep me from shaking, so I do the honest thing. I stand and shake, brush my teeth and shake, eat my lunch and shake, write my emails and shake, feel my breath and shake. Still too thin-skinned for words like deal breaker, I don't, divorce, unable to digest them, I spit them up and get back to what I know well, my puzzles, my laboratory. I stare at the scattered pieces and repeat my mantra. Tell a new story. 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 Tell a new story.
Surely there's an equation to remove that pit from the lover's stomach. One turn of phrase to evaporate those million tons. In that way, I am a scientist. In that way, I work tirelessly for the cure. To be open, bold. To carry the fruits of my labor back down the mountain, my arms overflowing with creation. Laying them down on a blanket, say, a story from your life for a work of art I've made. When you ask how much and feel serene certainty in that stock. These are dreams I have. Because the truth is that the logic of the heart trumps predictable seasons. Because the heart wins every time, and I don't even know why that is. <laughs> <laughs>